Last at Great Bowl transformed the game in the sense that no one before or since has bowled the Yorker with the accuracy that Lasset has done. Bowls Yorker, brilliant! Lasset Malinga at his best! It's the action. I mean, it's, it's a characteristic action that he possesses that no one else possesses around the world. Uh, the ability to fire in that spearing Yorker, uh, to bowl that incredible slower ball with his arm going at the same pace. Well, every cricket writer's dream, an action like that and a surname to go with it. Slinger Malinga. Well, I think Lusset was an absolute superstar. He was very smart. Uh, he thought really well about bowling and the game of cricket and that allowed him to be very creative with what he did and very effective with what he did. And I think we're very lucky to have him in the side because he was an out and out match winner. Gone. Four and four. This is brilliant. Who ever would have thought that this could possibly happen? He taught a lot of bowlers how to practice the Yorkers. He had the shoe that he kept in front of the stumps and he used to keep bowling at the shoe. That's something that I see a lot of the young boys do. So when you leave the game, this is something that you want to help youngsters achieve, something special. And that is what he's given the cricketing world. That's something most of the young boys these days do. Practice bowling a Yorker. And how do they do it? The Malinga way. You think Lasith, you think Yorkers, you think slower balls, you think Sri Lankan legend. Oh, it's a toe crusher! Fantastic! That is an outstanding Yorker! Well, that combination of, of Yorkers and those dipping slower balls that have made him so difficult for the modern batsman, and you combine that with his action, which is unusual and unorthodox, and has made him one of the best white ball limited overs bowl as we've ever seen. This has been the most magnificent display of fast hostile bowling. I think if Malinga had come up in some different countries then he would have probably been coached to bowl differently. Oh, I think Lasset Malinga was an outstanding bowler and one of the best T20 bowlers, one of the best bowlers full stop throughout his period. Now has he got it? Yes he has! Sri Lanka the new champions! of the ICC World D20, well played. I remember being on a tour of Sri Lanka and we played in a warm-up game and I opened it and this lad came on to bowl. I think he got me out for a duck because I was looking here and the ball came from there and this lad just ran up and let it go like that about 90 mile an hour and he was just so difficult to pick up. And he got better with age, that Yorker, that dipping slower ball. They go, the off stump uprooted. Malinga takes a fifth wicket. The smile that he has on his face constantly, I think that's what he will be remembered for the most, is the way he played his cricket, the spirit he played his cricket in. Oh, but they've got the kid. This has been a one-man show. Malinga the Marauder. What a performance by this youngster. What a, a phenomenal player he's been for Sri Lanka. Oh, beautifully bowled, magnificent delivery, off stump out of the ground. What a talent. No matter when he's turned up in white ball cricket, he has been absolutely brilliant, unorthodox, found a way and was an absolute genius. Pogger right up in the block hole. Just unbelievably gifted cricketer, typical Sri Lankan cricketer, fiery and unique. And he made the Yorker into a thing. And now that legacy is being passed on. So I'm happy that Lasset came. Think about Lasset Malinga. I'm never going to say I'm sad that he went, because what he left behind has been something that has made the game richer.